All right, let's go. I stopped picking up the audio. There we go. Frick, man. Freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Uh, would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. Gotta be alive. God damn it! Nick! We have to go. shouldn't be able to get through that. On the downside, we can't get through them. What are you looking at? Bite, man. You got bit. You don't got bit, bro. Staring ain't polite. What are you going to do? Hand me that there. Are you sure? I got nothing to lose. Other than my piggly wigglies, of course. <laughs> piggly wigglies. You can't really get a cool prosthetic in this time, though, to be fair. Oh, that's way too high. No, go lower. Go lower. Save your knee. Save your knee. Go lower. Save your knee. Bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Good day. Hell. Just. Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Yeah, if, you, if your ankle's fucked, then just go like just below the knee. I'd say, like, don't go all the way above it. Unless you have to. Like, about there is fine. <coughs> Anything in that? Sorry, it's empty. <coughs> Damn. 
I'll keep looking around. The keys are still in it. Well, worth a shot. Out of gas. Hmm. in there anything we can use a lot of cigs give me one of those do you have a lighter probably tastes like pine tar about now but i'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one hand it here sure right? <laughs> sure clone inside how to smoke oh yeah she has a lighter back yeah Joe, sure, what pre-made cigs like that taste disgusting i'm sorry That tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? We wait. Yeah, manufactured cigs like that taste fucking awful. I'm sorry, they just do. I always prefer to roll my own. And again, he was smoking while dehydrated. That's another thing. Shit in a five pound sack. He had a cigarette when he was already dehydrated. Jesus. Ten out of ten. Stuck in this can of all day. Not gonna help. You want to hear something funny? Sure. I've been thinking, and I don't want to die. <laughs> thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that but there it is I'm scared Clementine Jesus I'm scared you're going to be okay oh at least spare me the bedside bullshit sorry would you would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick I love that stupid kid no matter what you think, he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Will he remember it? Been almost a day. <laughs> will Pete <Pete'll> remember it? <laughs> I think he will. Where are you going? I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it i'll buy you some he's like with carly in the previous one like carly remember this instantly gets shot thank you pete you go find my nephew now right 
<laughs> Carly will not remember this. my signal and run straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. Let's get this over with. I remember for 20 seconds, yeah. I'm Oh seven Pete. He's a good in Oh seven Peter. Peter. Horse is here. <laughs> the horse is here. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you. Where's Alvin? Alvin. It's been hours. Where are they? We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus. We all got split up. I was with Pete, but. Thank God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told him not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. No worries, mate. I'll forget that you told me not to speak to your daughter again, but here we are. Say cheese. Hey, bestie. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? I want a Polaroid so bad. Okay. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? They're just fishing. I know that's not true. Sorry, I, I just need to... Do you want to see what I found? Oh god. Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? Uh. It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. You said there was no bullets in it. Hey, Luke's back! There's definitely bullets in it. I'm not risking a like playing with a gun and then accidentally shooting someone. I'm not teaching her. Fuck that. Her dad'll be pissed at me. But I have a feeling that if we don't teach her and she gets in danger, and then her dad's pissed that she was in danger and couldn't defend herself. Because like if she does shoot something, then it'd be like, oh thank you. Like I'm pissed at you for teaching her how to use a gun, but thank you because she won't be 
here otherwise or some shit like that. I'm, how would you bet that's going to happen? That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I, ca I can't breathe. Shh. Hello? Hello there. Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. Mm. You mind if I come in for a bit? Oh, God. Would you please leave? This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. We have a big group. Lots. Oh? How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Yep. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. A Spanish guy and his daughter. A quiet girl. A bit taller than you. A big black guy. This big. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. I'm scared. I don't trust this man, obviously. Well, it looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to 10 people with you. More. Hmm. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Now, I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Just passing through, going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. The cold slows them down. Well, that's not worth the trade, in my opinion. Hmm. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. It's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Just put it in a random drawer. Yeah, legit. Doesn't matter where you put a knife. Just put it down. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. Didn't say that. Nobody is here. Why the fuck are you bringing a gun? Dude, it's not your house. Get the fuck out. Hm. 
I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Well, it's a kid. Yeah. Looks like it was taken in this room. I don't know. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Yes, you can. You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? If you want to be back by then, you have to worry about that. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. Well, they told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. I didn't open the door. He just came in. I thought you opened the door. Jesus. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a mustache. Like mine, or more like Alvin's? Um, it was droopy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. And your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not going to do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the uh, leader of a camp not clip. far from here, and he's very smart. One thing I like about this game is that when you choose dialogue options, Look, it doesn't I'm interrupt. Sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Like it doesn't we interrupt the conversation, people. it we'll waits till the they've finished their sentence and then Clementine. it does your dialogue option. You know where he was, right? Yeah. Like right. in Life is Strange, like Everybody if you choose a dialogue option, it'll just interrupt what they're saying and just jump in. Which I think is pretty good. I like that it like waits for the dialogue to end and then you says yours. Yeah, just a little ways. So it feels like a natural conversation. Clem, sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. I still don't like what you did. Sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. 
I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. <laughs> I don't want to interrupt grown women. Thing. Yeah, sometimes I want to interrupt you know, them. I just want to be like, shut up. But... Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. You know, it feels like more of a natural conversation, doesn't it? I'm not comfortable with Unless you're talking with two people. On the... to be a mom's <laughs> Unless there's two people with no neurodivergent who just keep interrupting each other because they're both excited about the conversation. That man gets his wish. <laughs> God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Anyone see him? Found him. Oh my god. Oh, there he is. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. What? He didn't have a gun. Yeah. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's what? gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. Well, that was... that was Pete. I'm sorry. I'm worried about that kid. You keep an eye on him for me, would you? And you... sure you still want to come with us? Look. I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Here, eat this back. But we're almost out of food. 
We gotta save it. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. In some OPSEC, why not? Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Uh... Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Close. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Family. Family. It's a tough world out there Family. without people you Family. can trust. Family. <laughs> Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not going to get in the middle of it. Let me skip a chat. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I don't want to upset her. Me neither. Family. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. What do you think? I think we can take them. Clem didn't have I'll a... take the big one. Yeah, Clem didn't have a knife. Short. Wish we could use guns. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Oh, she has a hammer. pull it should come free i know i've done this before remember in a shed hmm. <coughs> nice work kid ow hmm. okay whacked it Family. <laughs> Family. <laughs> the Vin Diesel meme. Family. 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 I like that machete he's got. Oh, 
how did I know that was gonna happen? There's like no support underneath it. I'm okay. I just I'm stuck. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll, we'll figure something out. Behind you. Oh shit. Oh, she swore. Oh shit. Careful, Club. Like how he sees her as a capable adult. He could do yeah, exactly. Her off. Whack her. And again. Clem, you did it. Nice. Thanks, Clem. Have a hard ass. Well done. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. He has balls walking on the wooden bit. Just play it cool. You do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Hmm. Just don't make any sudden moves. I'd chew and me. Don't piss him off. Is he with Carver? It's hard to see. I don't think so. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. What do you want? Saw you coming, and I thought I'd meet you halfway. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. We're just people. Fair enough. You folks headed north, like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Uh, yeah. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Nick, no! God damn it, Nick. Why has it got to be so trigger happy? God damn. Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We got to get off this bridge. Let's go. Flush him. Who 
the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Everybody calm down. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. He wasn't going to do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit play one of role us. Play SMA. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. Sure. Thanks, Clem. It's gonna send her off on her own to check it out. Kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? And this is before the Luke uprising. <laughs> used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on his big plan, some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, "Nick, we're burning daylight," and that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He could have been anybody. Right. We don't know. How do we know he wasn't with Carver anyway? If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. If you can hear, it's all I had left of it. Outside, someone's you decided to mow the lawn. I'm gonna go talk to them. Right next to my window. Can't hear it. Okay, that's good. Or anything? Okay, good. Means my fucking noise gate is good. Look at here's Nick whining. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. The man said he had lots of food. There's got to be something left. I mean, we could use the pick. Ah, that's cool. Feels pretty good. Keep it. I guess he slept here. It's dead. I 
Whip it with a knife. Man, I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. Oh god, not the tin peaches. Oh god. Oh god, That's oh fuck. Funny. She looks just like you. <laughs> hey, Clem. That's brought on some silly memories. There's a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group. But I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. Clem can He's actually open it. <laughs> He's just losing it. Fucking ten peaches. God knows we're not Jesus Christ. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. Remembers Lily. Yeah. What the hell is that? Friggin' by the ten peaches. Walker's. I do want to play that game again, though. Should I? Here. Um, I really want to play yeah, um, Edith Finch right, again. We're heading up. I might play it again. Do you guys want to watch? Like, if you guys, if I play it again, would you guys watch it? It's a debate because I really enjoyed it, so I want to do it again. Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful. We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Solid. All right. No it. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I yeah, perfect. Oh, oh, is she? I want a treehouse. I had a shed. <laughs> but my mum called it. it was, you know, like if you have like a shed that you play in in the back garden. I don't know whether this is a thing everywhere else, but. Just call it like it a slow. Wendy house. I don't know why it's called a Wendy house. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Some of you apocalypse that want a tree house? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Oh. Oh, 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 you want to get like fine. a high up place you're like fine. in Firewatch. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just just slow down, just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. She has to make her remember her dead parents and Lee. Yeah, fair point. Made it. Ah! You see anything? I can and see the, the bridge. Medieval Castle Hill would be great. Mm. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. Which they made to withstand human tactics. Mm hmm. Oh, 
Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. No way. Kenny. No way. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? Also, fuck Kenny. I'll take that. Watch him. Yes. I thought I killed him. These people with you? Oh, you like fell in the we building and then. Great. I just started dinner. You fell in that building, right? Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Like Please, we're meant to get the walkie-talkie. Great time for ads. <laughs> Anyone sick of ads? Sub. <laughs> okay, if you can't afford to sub, it's fine. It's all good. I usually just get turbo. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. <laughs> we tend to be fair. Most Alexi has been subbed since like day one, so attention. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna but be like, yeah, the this up, storage, badge. We couldn't resist. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Don't worry about it, Alexia. Fun. <laughs> oh, nothing, Walt. Yo, is that Walter here's baby? one smart <laughs> some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans. Wait, why is too? my alerts quiet? Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun Where down. Where the bloody now. hell have you been? Gunny. Toilet. Toilet? What do you mean, toilet? You know, for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. Thank you so much, Breaker, for gifting this up to Alexia. I appreciate it. Dad, look. A Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. Ten subs off the goal. Isn't it you only got, like, looks at watch. One day left. <laughs> so it resets again. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? I don't really want to talk about him. Oh, hell. I'm sorry, darling. So, I'll just start crying again if we do. I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while. These guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there?
Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand, and then it got messier. For a minute there, it wasn't looking too good for old Kenny. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? A little princess, isn't she beautiful? <laughs> Jack, hey, looking Clementine. lovely today, lads. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Easy's making dinner, lovely. Well, help me prepare a little dinner. <laughs> so how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. I say, waiting to the tuna. <laughs> Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. My voice is like perfect for it. I'm sorry. It's so good. It hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Hmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Sure. What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. Fruit and legumes. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. Yeah. Huh. Striking resemblance. Just the pigtails. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Reminds me of school. Yeah, peaches and beans. Like beans are savory, peaches are sweet. I just I don't do sweet and savory together unless it's popcorn. Sweet and salty popcorn together, ten out of ten. Anything else? Absolutely not. Like same with um what's it called? Like chocolate covered um pretzels. Weird. Weird. What's this song you're humming? Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? Well, it's about a king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm I haven't storm. seen one of these After a since. Long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. But the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well... He's so different now. It's weird to see him now. I'll bet, but he's so happy to see you. Yeah. And I'm Cheese and peanut butter? Oh. Perfect. Yeah, I don't like now peanut butter. We just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Hey, yo, we're going to top the tree. All uh, right, let's find something. Oh, 
Oh, what duck. A funny little guy. Silly goofy guy. I don't like that I can't turn the camera around. Crazy. Is that power of concert, October thirteenth, nineteen ninety eight. Is that power of those brand new eyes off? <laughs> To see a butterfly on something, I'm like, is that powerful? Kenny's duck. I'm gonna go upstairs and have a look up there, see if there's anything we can. Go to the on the tree. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. Is he gonna shoot that one? <laughs> it's been a week, man. Gotta be out of the woods. Break it down. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. Oh, no. I will take that. That's nice, I guess. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting. Oh, I should have chose like the like angel, should I? Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you. As if you wanted to like Kenny you. Does yeah. different to you? I didn't know him before. And, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. He seems like the same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, hon. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Jeez, all right. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? All right. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? 
everything's so fucked up. It's not gonna be easy. I know it's gonna be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You wanna listen? That food smells good, huh? Can I? She's gonna be a runner. So that redneck Kenny, yeah. It's not his. Well, how do you know? I just do. We were trying for so long and, and then if Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. Imagine telling a 10 year old being like, I can't believe I'm hey yo, who are fucking advice. a lot that have fucked someone else. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. <laughs> like, when, when, <laughs> this is the thing that confuses me about fucking heteros, right? Just sit at a dinner table, granny and everything there, right? And they'll just be like, yeah, we're trying for a baby. You're just telling them that you're just fucking all the time, raw dogging it all the time. Why? Why? You okay, why man? say that? Why? Yeah, just. The fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> just try to forget. They just about tell it. everyone in your nan that you're raw dogging every night. Strategically raw dogging. <laughs> like what? I'd lose my day. That's same. If someone dead ass told me that they were trying for a baby, yeah, I'd be like, okay. I don't need to know that. <laughs> Keep that to yourself, honey. <laughs> so, Clem, we were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? What's his name? Luke? He in charge? I don't need to know him? that. It is oh, weird, right? Sarita, we don't know these folks. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? I think so. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. If that's what she wants. Of course she does. Right, Clem? Thank you. Of course. This is like a dream. Damn it, I am so happy right now. I, I can't even tell you. Hey there. Hey. <laughs> Hope you like the food. So anyway, oh, we're just yes. fucking all right. I'm really Thank fucking you. I bro, my savage. Great for nutrition. We were just pregnant, like you two were like <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I know what you two were doing. It's so it's, it's weird. I don't and Nick. I don't like it. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just Frida's saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the I winter. don't like it. Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? Yeah, it's in the north. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? Hey, Keke. You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land cold ass winter so the walkers get slow sounds like bullshit listen vanilla ice i don't know what your deal is but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning that'd be just fine by me what's the deal with these guys clam hey fuck you buddy it's fine nick we're not staying please don't fight gentlemen please there's no need for this now look we've all had a long vanilla day. ice i love that please eat Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> duck? Who's duck? Leave him alone, Luke. 
Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? No, I'm uh, Give him a hug or something, my god. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher, and I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? I want to stay with you and Kenny. Then stay you shall. I know that'll please Kenny. I missed him. And he missed you, I can assure you. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. Hey, yo. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits Oh, yeah, he's an English teacher. Of course he's gay. always make the right choice. Right? <laughs> maybe. And maybe not. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you can tell How right the stereotype. <laughs> I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? We need lesbians, though. Oh, politics. There better be lesbians the in hell? one of these games. Oh, there better be. Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just going to check the windows round back before this storm hits. You, you definitely vote for Trump. Sure. He'd, he'd definitely vote for Trump. I'm sorry. He would have. Miss? Don't shoot her. Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss? Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then Bit we'll of have to get to know her. Why don't like one of you go inside? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. One of you go inside, get the food. The other one come out. Thank you. Really, but that storm Give her the food. They fuck off. Gotta get back to my family. So you'd have to be I'll like, hey, come in, have food. Have do that. No, no, it's Here fine. In Canada, it's more French teacher. <laughs> Amazing. We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. I have a little girl like you. <laughs> it's not How impressed. Old are you, sweetie? Oh, she's 11 now. I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. She was nine in the last game. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't like, she just turned nine at the end of the last no, game. Thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. I thought should be nearly 11. It was 18 months. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Clementine. Don't freak out. Listen. Saying don't freak out is gonna make someone that guy freak out. The bridge was Walter's friend.
Yeah, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. Oh shit, that was his partner. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. <laughs> Don't oh. freak out. Why? Why should I not be freaking out? Keep an eye out for Nick. Exactly. Right so it said to me. What's Don't up? freak out. I'd be like, why? Why? Oh, uh, what's going on? nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. Let's be honest no, with him. Tell him. Just go back to bed, Nick. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it. It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. Yeah, if, he, has, if no, he wants to tell can. him, tell him. Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I yeah, got tell it. him. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but fuck. I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's going to do? Either way is risky. Exactly. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? You should tell him. It's gone. Oh shit. Are you okay? I always liked this knife. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. Not gonna lie to him. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then, but now. It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um, I don't feel good. Nick shot him. Is, uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge? Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, I thought I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter.
the wind turbine doing? Whoa. What's going on? The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nate, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. Got the tree stand perfectly still, yeah. Go. Gotta check it. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No, it's too dangerous. It's the rest of you, get this thing shut down. Does anyone know how to do this? Watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. All oh, those 2D trees. much ammunition we got to get back to the lodge they're behind us It's hard to shoot the clam, Jesus Christ. trainer well enough <laughs> oh, sorry fucking hay fever oh jesus <laughs> fucking hell i mean uh... Okay. What the hell? <laughs> 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 
That is, I love that. Oh god, it's that guy. Howdy, folks. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Hmm. It's nice to see you too. Oh! Damn it! Sarah! Inside. It's you. Keep moving. Leave this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. Fucking huge. Built this case. Oh, discount Danny Lawrence. Oh my god, I was waiting for someone to say that. <laughs> kind of. Kind of. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. We should watch Carmilla soon. Depending on what time we finish this. Like finish the this uh, this season. Definitely. Deja vu for motel time. Mm -hmm. Deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there, and Alvin, and Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice and show your face. I don't know what it is. <laughs> He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Beck, the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? He won't kill a doctor. He'll do anything. Oh. Con can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please. We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Go ahead. Go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't look, sweetie. Don't look. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Oh, shit. Bill, stop! Ah. Ah! Oh. <laughs> you all right? Fuck you, Bill. Oh. You don't want to do this. Please, let these people go. Just shut up. Clem, could you reach my hands? Oh, his fingies. Oh. Everything under control? I'll try. Kenny! 
Don't move. I can't see him. Watch them. Leave him alone is the only gay rep we have. No! 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 God no. damn it! Please stop! That's for our man. Now I didn't want to do this. Fuck's sake. But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. <laughs> Two days before Pride Month. This is released on YouTube. It will be Pride Month. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you remember George Alvin? Fuck. See, I do. I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... Oh, you could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! I love you, Beck. Bill, please! Please, don't do this! <laughs> nice. Oh, it was only in the shoulder. Oh, <gasps> oh but No! Rebecca, don't look! Just don't look, Rebecca. Kenny! Stop it! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh Jesus. I can keep this up all night. We can do this all night. Is that what you want? You're killing off all the main characters. No! <laughs> Up is what the fuck? Where's Luke? Finally, cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home as a family. <laughs> All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. Too many characters to, yeah. Yeah, they do need to trim, trim the main character bush a little bit. I don't know if we could have saved Walt, but I know one of us didn't just give up. Yeah, I know. Folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and... They all have a vital role to play in this community. They oh, the communism. The yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them. Knowing full well, those who choose not to accept our love will surely wish that they had. A storm is on the way. So it's in categories now. So it's friendship, loyalty, honesty, forgiveness, and bravery. So I'm guessing like, depending on what you, obviously what you do for these depends on what happens later. Hmm. Okay. 